Today, I want to talk about a PC software that can completely change the way you do productivity. I'm talking about a PC, uh, software that can enhance your productivity by giving you multiple special windows. So you have virtual monitors. You can have three, two, one, four, six. I mean, the, it's a, it has a handless customization. Now, this software isn't just only compatible for Windows. It's also compatible for Mac and they are working to make it compatible to for Linux as well. So this is definitely the video for you. If you've been looking for a uh, PC software that could work with your Rainios, your Rokis, your x reels your Vitures. This software is compatible with a few different glasses that makes it very, very special. So it was developed by a developer named Rohit. And it put in a ton of work into this software. And when you load the software, you can really see just how flexible it is. But let me give you a quick backstory. Actually, before I give you guys the backstory, don't forget that I'm still giving away the extra eye. So please subscribe to my channel. And thank you guys for supporting. As I said in the past, as my channel grows, I could potentially give away a Beam Pro, one of these glasses. Just subscribe and stay tuned to my channel. But anyway, backstory. A couple years ago, I made a uh, video about a software called Ginger XR. Ginger XR was incredible because it worked with different glasses and it was very early before most of us had access to the native PC software. So at that time, I only had actual glasses. So Ginger XR was what I had, what I could use before uh, Nebula for Windows came out. And then when Nebula for Windows came out itself, it, while it worked on my PC, it didn't work on many people's PC. It was buggy. It was slow. It consumed a lot of power. So, you know, many of us had to depend on Ginger XR. And then I don't know what happened with Ginger XR, but it sort of just disappeared away. And then came AR Money. I also made a video about AR Money. AR Money was also special because it worked with a few different glasses. And then that one just sort of disappeared. And now keep in mind that all these glasses have some kind of their own PC software, except for Rokit, as far as I know. Now we have this software called Virtual XR by Rohit. Once again, you guys should follow if he has an Instagram or Twitter, whatever it is. Just go ahead and tell him thank you because he put on a lot of work into this. This is the home page of the website, right? There's going to be a link in the description. You want to click on download. And then if you have a Mac, you click on Mac. If you have Windows, you click on Windows and you pretty much download it and set it up. Now, once you set it up, you're going to go into the, you're going to click on it and it's going to come on. And all you have to do is simply plug your glasses in. If you have the Roki, the radio or the features, the only exception is the, uh, the extra and that's because extra has a native three dove in it. So what you want to do is you want to go into the glasses settings and turn off, uh, stabilizer, stabilizer mode, turns it off and makes it zero dove. Once you turn off the zero dove, then you can plug in to the PC. But once again, for every other glasses, you just plug straight into the PC and voila, you're going to start working. So right now I have a 0.05 version. Once again, it's still in early development. They're still working on it. So there might be a few bugs here and there, but for what it is right now, it is pretty incredible. And I think it's worth checking out, especially if you've always wanted to have multiple screens. For example, the x has native uh, 32 by 9 and 21 by 9 ultra wide screens, but sometimes i want to have individual windows so you know now with this man the amount of windows you can literally use is crazy so what i'm going to do right now is put my glasses on and do a screen recording that way you guys can get a better view of this so connect your glasses it's going to pop up and you're going to click on and then you're going to see quick start as you can see here, I have multiple display. I have three, uh, six display option, or I can even go to a four display option. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on three display and start off with this one right here, and then I click on launch. Once you click on launch, it's gonna guide you through the calibration, and you're gonna be greeted with this 
3 display window. As you guys can see, this is my field of view, right? And this is what I see when I have any of the glasses on. I can pan to the left, you know, to see what's on my left side, back to the middle, or I can even pan to the right side, which is going to be my right. Now to adjust this display, uh, each, each and every one of this display, I'm going to click on this icon right here. Click the play sign and you're going to see this drop down options. We're going to go to display and I'm going to show you just how customizable this display is. So virtual display, so I can click on this and watch what happens when I hit the curvature, right? Just look at that curve. You can change the curvature of each and every one of the displays to exact position you want it. You can always reset back and then we can do position as well. This you want to memorize the numbers in case you mess with it, but you can use it as you can see, you can move the plane in X, Y direction or even in the Z. But what you want to do is make sure that you definitely remember the numbers and then just play around with it till you like the way it looks for you. If you're wondering what any of these settings does, just look at what I manipulate and then look at what happens to the display. Now I'm gonna speed it up so that way I can show you guys the other forms of display. If you have issues with setting up your uh, PC software, you can always come back to this video and use the YouTube's play button to slow it down. That way you guys can see exactly what I'm doing. But basically, you can customize it to however you want in whatever position you want with this uh, software. With the keyboard shortcuts, you can zoom in and out of the display and you can uh, also focus on whichever display you want to. So now let me show you the four window display option. I just showed you the three window. Now we're going to. Uh, do the quad screen and launch. Once you launch the quad window, quad uh, virtual window, you're gonna you're gonna see you can basically pan your head up and down, and you have four giant monitors. And you can also change the aspect ratio as well as adjust each um, window, virtual window, just like I was adjusting in the other part of the video. You can adjust the curvature, the tilts of this window you can man there's you can adjust the spacing there is so much customization you can do with this thing once again i sped it up that way you guys can see some of its capabilities but if you're ever in a situation where you did too much and you want to go back to the previous settings just come down to the bottom of the screen and hit reset and it's going to reset back your display now you can also use the keyboard shortcuts to actually zoom in and out of the display if you want to focus on any particular area of the screen all you have to do is use w and s to zoom in and out or if you know what the display number is just press the display number and for example if i hit one it's gonna uh, zoom in to this display right here then you can use other numbers to toggle through different displays and have each one in the middle of your focus so i can have my youtube on my main focus while the other display is still in and active and this display works just like you would on any windows i don't know how mac works but it works just like any physical monitors um, except it's just virtual so you can move things uh, or windows or web pages all around as you want so anyway guys, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. If you have any question, put it down in the comment section. And uh, thank you for your support guys. Peace.